the upstairs to Ann Curry. How to thanks this morning on today's fitness, the big winner on the biggest loser. Bill Germanakos was a 334 pound father of three with a lot of love, but not a whole lot of mobility. Determined to be an active dad, Bill joined NBC's hit reality show. His goal was not only to be the next winner, but also the biggest loser. Bill, your starting weight was 334 pounds. Your current weight is. <laughs> So let's introduce you to Bill. Let's take a look at his picture before, one more time, and now here's Bill after. Bill, congratulations. Look at you. I don't much, recognize man. you from that um, image. It's a uh, big difference. Have big a difference seat, because sure. I actually want to also introduce your twin brother. Yes. We have, a, I think, a before picture of your brother, Jim, who's also on the program. And that's coming up. He weighed there 361 pounds. Oh, we don't have the picture. Anyway, well, here's Jim afterwards. Well, we know it's a lot of nice a lot of weight that you lost. Come in. Good to see you too. Welcome. You. So here we have a double whammy, a double uh, success story here. Um, I want to start, though, with how it started, which is that your dad was very overweight and yeah. he died young in his 50s. Yeah, he was only 57 years old. and. Um, you know, that's something that, uh, you know, uh, as we got older and we got into our 40s and found out that, you know, we were suffering from blood pressure problems and cholesterol problems and, uh, you know, uh, on our dad, you know, at 57, something we didn't want to face, mm -hmm. leaving our, our wives and our children. How long were you that overweight, Bill? Um, you know, from the time I was, um, from the time I was young, I was... Um, 18 years old when I first injured my knee playing uh, sports in college. I was a lacrosse player, and um, so you're for, saying for decades. For decades, and it just kept adding Jim, on. Jim, also you too for decades. Were you that overweight for decades as well? Right. Well, you know, it it, it, it comes and goes. Depends on how active you you know I was, uh, but yeah, it's been a problem all my life. You guys have lost it the old-fashioned way. Absolutely. Uh, really inspired by love, love for your father, love for your children, wanting to be be there a long time for them. Well, we, we recently lost a friend, you know, that was in our age group, and, you know, he, he left a house full of kids, and, uh, you know, it's very upsetting, and, and then to know that we were on uh, the path for, uh, you know, an, uh, an early death as well, it, it's something when we had the opportunity to go ahead and do this, it's something that we, uh, we jumped at, because, you know, this is, a, there was an opportunity of a lifetime, and, uh, you know, it, it, the results speak for themselves. And you did it. You did it by working out. You did it by uh, eating less, eating good food. So you won 250000 Yes. And you won 100000 by for, for losing the most weight after being voted off the island. And now, so now not only are you thinner and stronger, you're kind of wealthy. So what are you going to do with all this? What, what, what is this new life going to give to you? Well, well, each of us has three children, you know, mm -hmm. and we've got uh, a house load of responsibilities. So, um, you know, uh, I, I'm sure that um, I could speak for Jim as well that, you know, it'll go towards, um, you know, sending the kids through college, uh, especially. That's That was my main goal. And, uh, you know, um, and to give them a little bit of, um, you know, the, the things they need, so right. to speak, around the house. You have to figure they, they sacrificed a lot while we were, you know, going through this journey. Our mm -hmm. wives were very supportive. My wife uh, had to leave her job in order to, uh, to support the house while I was in the gym. And she did you know? that why? She did that because she cared about me, because she cared about us, and because she knew that this was going to mean a better life for us. So really one of the, one of the messages from your stories is the supportive family of siblings. I'm could sure you two helped each other a great deal. Could not have done it? Could not have done it without, without my wife. Without your wife? Without no, my wife. Not. And the same goes for us. And Who could you um, not have done it without? You know, without, without the, the, the love and support of uh, my wife Stephanie and my, my children Adrian, Luke, and Hope, who are, uh, you know, this is what we did it all for. And, uh, and we each have, you know, three kids, and the thought for me was, geez, I really need to be able to walk these so two girls down the aisle. The one real day. message then from your winning then is that if you have someone you love who is obese and you want them to live, then you need to step up and support them and not enable them to stay <coughs> obese, but rather step up and encourage them to That's have right. the new life that you two have. Well, and, well there's some, if I can say something, a lot of people have said, um, well, you know, you guys, everybody, all the contestants took off from work. Uh, everybody had nothing but time to train. You know, both of us continued to work. He works two jobs, you know. In other words, he has interests here and there. I work 12-hour tours as a police officer without my wife, Valerie, being home. 
to take care of it. But the only thing we didn't do was I didn't sit on the couch. I didn't waste a lot of time. You know, uh, I continued to cut the grass, continued to clean the pool, drive the kids if I could. But, you know, I owe them. I owe them a lot now because well, they... Uh, I'm sure they hear you this morning. They did a lot. And There's, I'm sure they're going to feel that. I, I'm sorry, we have to, we've run out of time. I okay. know there's much there's more to say. Well, um, um, no problem. I was going to say that uh, very quickly that, you know, there's so many people that have come out and said, listen, I know a great trainer that can train with you and a great nutritionist. Listen, find the people that are obese and unhealthy and don't wait for them to lose 160 pounds before you offer up the people that you know. Help them now because, believe me, we needed help and we found the help. So. Bill and Jim, thank you so much, Jim Anacos, this morning. Congratulations, and thanks for inspiring people. Thank you also so much. Also, by being it's a pleasure here. pleasure to be here. And, uh, by the way, on January 1st, a whole new season of The Biggest Loser is kicking off right here on NBC. And still to come this morning.